Hey friends, it is Trucker Ray with you, coming from Auburn, Washington. And we're at the Safeway Distribution Center out here in Auburn. If you've been here before as a driver, you'll know. And there just happens to be another Key West driver next to me here. Haven't seen who it is yet. But, uh, yeah, we made it here at, uh, <coughs> excuse me, um, yeah, our time, 7 a.m. We made it here. Um, I noticed that there's a whole bunch of, uh, I was told there's no overnight parking here, but there's a huge staging area over here. When I leave today, I'm going to ask the security guard if there is a, um, if you can park there overnight, if you have a delivery the next morning. I got a feeling they're going to say yes, because there's a lot of parking spots here. And uh, I had to pay $25 last night to park in Kent because there's no parking in this area. So, uh, oh, what do you do? Oh, boy, I need to shave, don't I? Apologize for that. Haven't had a chance to shave yet. It was a very, very busy weekend. I had my windshield replaced. I had some other things done. I got some new curtains for my truck because the truck didn't have any curtains when I... Uh, <laughs> when I got it. So now I have some privacy, which is really nice. So... Thank you, Key West, for getting me that. When something needs to be done or replaced on the truck, they don't waste any time. They get it done. They really do. So I had a very, very good weekend. I've been working on my next video, which is a bit of a long one. Uh, the Bible break will be uploaded separately because it's that long. It's going to be about an hour and 38 minutes, the next video. It's just me driving from Ontario to, uh, to Langley, to New Westminster, doing a delivery in New Westminster, or dropping a trailer, that is. And that just goes to show you how busy that video will be just the amount of bad weather i was dealing with and just craziness just craziness so yeah it's going to be a bit of a long video so i hope you're okay with that i know you guys like the long videos I want to thank you all for your wonderful comments on our 10 year anniversary video wow i did not expect it to go over as well as it did people have just been so very very gracious and very very kind um on uh, just the wonderful comments that you've uh, left one person actually left a comment that uh, that I was being narcissistic. <laughs> Isn't that hilarious? Well, that was a real narcissistic video, but I enjoyed it. He said, and like, how uh, how am I being narcissistic? I mean, I was just sharing my journey in the last ten years. I am far from a arrogant person. Uh, I was just sharing my journeys. It was like sharing a journal. Uh, that's. <laughs> That's all it is all about, right? Just sharing, uh, just sharing what I went through in the last ten years, like a like a video journal. So anyway, um, yeah, this gentleman over here. I don't know if he watches my updates. TWT, he's out of California. That company. I uh, met up with him at the guard shack this morning. He says, "Hi, Trucker Ray. I watch your videos." And really nice gentleman. I can't remember what his name was. It's a very. Uh, hard to pronunciate his name super nice guy and uh it was kind of neat you just never know who you're going to meet out here right and uh it's really a blessing but anyway i i'm glad that you guys enjoyed the video it was really fun to put that together boy it took a long time to do but it was fun and i've even had a couple of friends of mine say you know you should enter this um, in a contest somewhere or whatever i'm like oh you know i don't even know where there would be even a contest or something like that and and I really don't need that kind of um, acknowledgement. I just wanted to share what I went through in the last 10 years. I wanted to share with people what was going on in my brain for the last 10 years. A lot of things that went on in my life that I really wanted to share with people that at the time I didn't. But I was able to do that in the 10 year anniversary video. That the last 10 years of my trunking experience was, was enjoyable. It was, there was a lot of pain, there was a lot of hardship, there was tragedy, but you know what? It's life. But the most important thing out of that entire two part video is that no matter what I went through, I'm still standing with Yahweh. I'm still standing with Yeshua. And he's gotten me through the whole thing, the whole battle, the tragedies, the heartbreak, the good times, the bad times. He got me through it and he's still with me, which is I am living proof that no matter what you are dealing with, no matter what battle you're going through, you stand uh, firm on your prayer and trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding and all your ways acknowledge him 
and he will direct your paths. And he has been faithful to me. <laughs> I felt like I've been on the threshing floor a couple times, but uh, he's been very faithful and very good to me. And now he's blessed me with a very good company to work for. So um, I, I just tried to persevere. And, uh, <laughs> but anyway, I thank God for everything that he's done for me. So what, what's going on with me right now? I'm doing a delivery of, of, of firewood over here at the Safeway Distribution Center in Auburn. And then from here, I'm heading over to the uh, Yakima, Wananichi area where I'm going to grab a load of apples. And it's going to St. Louis out in Mexico. So that's where we're heading. So, and I'm taking you guys along for the ride because you just never know what's going to happen out here. But that's all I have for you guys. Please keep me in your prayers. Uh, my sweet, uh, darling Mary Dwyer, um, precious lady, I'm going to call you later. So hopefully, either I'm going to call you later today or tomorrow, okay? So uh, be, be listening for the phone to ring because I wanted to have a chat with you. And uh, I don't know why I'm mentioning that, but I guess I wanted to send that message on to her if she, if she gets it. Um, very excited about your news, Mary. Very excited. And I, I've read all your emails. I just haven't had a chance to respond to much. All right, friends, that's all I got for you. Again, we're in Auburn, Washington, and we're at the Safer Distribution Center. And we're, uh, we're probably just about done here, but we still got a red light back there. <laughs>